All right, folks, Kelly in here again. Master Beats. We're down here at a mark in North Donegal. Not going to say where, but what we are doing is we are fishing for some conger in. Nothing too strenuous. We're just going to drop baits down the side of this pier into that. Nice sheltered harbour here in. Nice sheltered harbour here we're fishing. Um, you can probably hear it there at the moment, you'll not see it too well, but the tide is barely coming in, very hectic, a lot of swells. I have my rod set up there, it's like a budget Shakespeare setup with a Accius iron lip. That reel there packs a punch. It is a big fish Norwegian spinning reel. I have that spilled to the brim with 80 pound braid. So that will hold any big fish that is going to take an interest in my bait. My bait for the day is some frozen mackerel, still defrosting there. I'll be putting healthy slivers down there, down just down the side. Christy's here with me as well, Angler Hollux. He has his, um, he has his um, bait there as well. So we're just going to set up here, drop baits down the side, nothing too strenuous. Chill out, we'll get the stove going, we'll get some we'll get some sausage baps and some turkey burgers and we'll just chill out for the day, drink some tea and coffee. Sure way, wouldn't you, on the day that's in it? It's a bit cold there at the minute, it's about, it's about 8 degrees, fairly blustery, but this is what we're up against, this is what we have to do to catch these fish. If we're able to do it, we'll have something for the camera, hopefully a double figure conger. And yeah, we'll show you the setup and we'll hopefully show you a fish. This is the setup Christy's opting for. He's his sweet gripper weight there with his main line tied through there. And then he has just attached another line, no swivels, nothing too fancy. Very simple setup because when you're fishing conger, you are going to lose gear. It's snaggy territory, so don't waste too much time in fancy rigs or fancy anything. Literally a line going to your weight and then another line coming off and a leader then attached to your hook. Even use oil nuts or anything? Use oil nuts as weights. I would recommend we don't have that at the minute. We're not in the we're not in a position to be using nuts, so we're gonna to have to set settle for a nice wee grip weight. But Christy has his leader coming off and a full Mac Joey mackerel attached to it. He's just nicked it through the back kind of jaw area, the back of the head, through the jaw, and he's just beat elastic and a full mackerel on there now. We also have have, what I have is I have a drum, a full ass drum of mackerel oil. We're going to soak our baits in that later. Christy also has his drum of mackerel. He is a holy mackerel fish oil. We're not sponsored by them either, so but feel free to sponsor us if we're doing good. That's his bait there, that's his, his conger bait. Full Joey mackerel, bait elastic to his rig. I have my rig set up, very similar. I have my 80 pound braid attached to my weight and then another line with my leader coming off. The leader I am using is Yuki 3G Invisible's 130 pound breaking strain. So a conger be doing well to get through that. I'll tell you about maybe not even six inches, maybe six to 14 inches of that. Put on an 8-0 circle hook. Christy's using 6-0s, are they Christy? 8-0 Mustad O'Shaughnessy's. He's using, I'll use the old master bait circles. They are freaking strong old hooks i'll get one here now for you and then i'll show you my rig once i am all sorted here but this is what i'm using i can get one out my hands are that cold because we're we're fishing cold territory Edo circle that is look at this nice short shank circle for easy on hooking and yeah nice short strong shank that is a strong hook the barb goes into itself too, so it spins around in the fish's mouth for easy on hooking. But big fish hook, hopefully a big fish and a big bait going down now shortly. The beauty of conger fishing is there is no wild hassle involved. You're just sitting here, rods just fishing away. Christy's rods fishing away. I'm sitting here and I'm just having a cup of tea. Well, it's coffee in this case, but. Nice hot cup of coffee. You can probably see the steam coming off my thermos flask. Yeah, you sure can. Warm me up for the day. I'll get the stove going. I'll get the sausage baps and all the rest. And yeah, looking forward to the dinner later. Just 
a wee update there. I'm still drinking my tea, chilling out. Had a few wee knocks on the rod. Had one take there, didn't materialise. Christy hooked two and lost two. <laughs> He's having a, a very unlucky day. So he it's is... going to change now. The hook's going back and through three, four yeah, times there. No, that's that'll, that'll hold him. What he did wrong was he put a forty pound leader on first, and the conger just ripped through it like a hot knife through butter. Um, I gave him the hundred and thirty pound UK there now, so he should. He should have something better to, you know, a bit of, a bit of leeway for holding. I'm going to still drink the coffee, keeping me nice and hot, and then um, hopefully I'll have a conger by dinner time. Yes, yes. So, Christy seems to be into a fish. He's just biting him there now at the moment. I've got the lighting on there now. Let's see my choice is just sitting there. You getting the Oh, just, just tighten up your, tighten up your spoon. Come here. Um, the star drag there, yeah. so push that forward, push that good and forward, and yeah. don't let him take mine. Right, he's in there now. Yeah, he's in the hole, is he? Aye. Just a steering for a long fight if you have him in the hole, so just watch. Sorry. Just be careful. Don't want to pull that. Are you showing the boot, the man? Yeah. Just got the crutches off today, they do this. <laughs> uh, we go to some measures around here. Yes, Chrissy, you're getting them, you're getting them. Just don't, don't put too much pressure on oh, because. Oh, come out there. Um, oh, come on. Better come off. Something happened there. Came off with that. Oh god. Aye, the bait is absolutely destroyed. Eh? Look at that, eh? Aye, I see the, the job he did on your bait. Oh my god, is I, it's like The Walking Dead when they hit Glenn with the fucking baseball bat with the. Oh, it's free gone, mate. Right? Show me that. Look at the job he did on Christie's mackerel. Aye, you never came out of him. He just went to town on him. See that's what happened there, Christy. He he had here gripped. Yeah. If he had here gripped, he wasn't getting away. But yeah, we live and we learn. We'll get the next one in a bit, folks. There's fish here to be caught, so we're in high hopes. All right, lads. Brad's right. fishing away. Fishing away. And the dinner's on, boys. Kiwi sausages. Kiwi babs. Once they're all ground up, I'll have a wee turkey burger. They shouldn't be too long, hopefully. And the gas fairly on, nice and hot. We'll be enjoying that in about 15 minutes hopefully and then we'll be well fed, watered and another wee fish then for the biggest local. I think I might have something here Christy. Yeah. Yep, Christy this is it. Folks, I'm ecstatic here just as the sausages are cooking there. As you can see Christy wants them sausages. I got a nice, already fell in, a nice four, five pounder strap would you say? God, she's angry too. What will, what will we call her, Betsy? Left by the line. Left by the line. You hold this and see. I'll get my wee cloth. Hold them. Oh no, you need to hold them. We need a conger king now to show us how it's done. Jesus, she's burning too. She is angry. I think Christy, a nice one. Nice, nice. nice. Look at the tail, look at the muscular body while we cook them on the stove. <laughs> you can eat these, you know. Yeah. I'll get her on hooked here and we'll wait her, will we? Yeah. Circle hook. See them partons of circle hooks, Christy? You just turn them. Watch the fingers. She's spinning. I have players here if you want them with. No, I don't need players with a circle hook. Teeth on her. There we go. That's the fish. Wait, hold on for a picture. She is slippery. Use your cloth, maybe? No, don't need it. Get the header into me, Dad. Yeah, how did we get? We bother oh. weighing her. Hold on, hold on. I'd like to get a better picture. Look at the tail, look at the muscularness in the tail. There we go. Iron lip doing the business. Get her on my, my camera there. How do I do that? Is this rolling there, is it? It's recording, like Aye, that'll do. We'll get her back then while we wait now. It's only a wee one. Right, get back we'll on. say about six pound, five pound. Yep. That'll do. Ha ha! Yep. Ugh. I had a lot of lads on the ground, but I still got all the. Wild 
Mark and Kyle makes an appearance here. First one of the night, well, we, it's a nice strap. Christy's sitting here. And Christy is very big. Them. He's been sitting here the last 10 minutes. He's snapping away, but American. It's nothing to be, it's nothing to turn your nose up at. What do you think? Uh, it's not a blank anyway, not sure. A blank anyway. It's good to see for mid November. Aye. But aye. That's the start of it. Hopefully, we have a few more. We'll wait here and we'll get a, we'll get a picture then, Martin, will we? Aye. For sure, we'll. And hopefully, Chris, by the time we have it, we have it uh, weighed, Christy will hopefully have his. It's a good show for you, the best uh, kit here anyway, and I think I could have something not good. But I'll check, yeah, I think I have a push too. Three pound American card, nice wee strap cogger. Marty showed us how it's done here with that. Seven pound. I'm taking bets. What do you think, Chrissy? What do you think, Marty? Uh, it might be far off the seven. It might be far off the seven, Marty. Right. We have a few more now for tonight. That's a that is a lovely one, though. That is a lovely one. Christy gets his first. It's a very light bite too. The death roll. Can you see the the hook guy? I can get a grip of it. Maybe I get the T bar on. Maybe. I always scissory tape on him. Nice fish, Just clean it up tonight, Christy. Nine pound. So I uh, we'll get a wee picture here now and we'll get her get her 